Welcome back to a new cruise adventure. This time, we embark on one of the largest cruise ships in the world, Royal Caribbean's Harmony of the Seas. Come along and let us show you all the fun activities we did in our seven-day cruise from Galveston, Texas. <laughs> the journey began like this. We went to Houston days earlier to ensure that our embarkation day would go smoothly and to minimize the potential problems and delays. After settling in Houston, we went to try the fast food joint Jack in the Box. The next day, we drove down to Houston's downtown and tried a restaurant called Dozone. They are famous for their soup dumplings and in Chinese called Siu Long Bao. Coming from Canada, we found driving in Texas more challenging as cars were going a lot faster and the road structures were more complex with tons of bridges and exits from the freeway. Know the restaurant is good when the lineup is long. We waited nearly half an hour, but at last we got a table. Unfortunately, we had to split up a party of 10, but we were still sitting pretty close. We ordered a lot of food, and after trying this, I can definitely say this place is a good place if you're wanting to try soup dumplings. The interior was also really nice too, which helped the dining experience. So we got three, three rounds of siu long bao, yep. and this one is, what is this one again? This is just pork. pork. This one's just pork, but we also got one that is crab and chicken. No, crab and pork and crab meat, and then chicken. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, pretty good though. They're full of juice, and they don't break easily. We just finished having dinner at Dozo. And we ordered like a lot of food and I think the best was probably their shallow mouths and their dumplings. They were very juicy and full of soup. So yeah, that was pretty good. Our first time here and we'll definitely come back. After dinner, we went to check out a nearby Costco because the American Costco is slightly different from Canada's. And we also taste tested a churro. We just finished having dinner and now we're at a Costco at the US checking it out. We got a big twisted Cheerio and churro. now we're gonna try it. Churro? Churro, churro bro. Oh yeah, it's called churro. But yeah, now we're all gonna try one piece. Here's the churro. Churro taste test. Yeah, it's mad. It's mad. It's mad. Okay, yeah. Jackie, Jackie shake his head too. So we're now at Seven Leaves. It's a bubble tea shop and I got this one right here, Taro Milk Tea. I got the Taro one. It's like the bits of it. I didn't find anyone try. Taro's pretty good. We are now at Target in the US. Look at those Lego guys, they're humongous. Chick-fil-A and we're just gonna get some late night snack. Oh yeah, gotta use the sauce. Chick-fil-A sauce. Alright, this is the next day now and this is the day where we embark the ship Harmony of the Seas and right now we're at the hotel breakfast. Yeah, they have really nice breakfast here. I had it yesterday as well because we were here a, a day before and they have some nice sausage and eggs and waffles. And yeah, we're gonna be on the ship today. That's very exciting. One thing to note was our drive from our hotel, which was nearby the airport, took us roughly one hour to drive to the cruise terminal. After the long and exhausting drive, we finally made it and could see the ship. Our vacation was just around the corner. We are now at the Galveston Cruise oh, Terminal yeah. 10 oh, and yeah. we're at the check-in oh, yeah. area but we're just yeah. waiting for the rest of our parties before check-in. Very excited and we'll show you more. <laughs> Alright, so we now have passed security and all the check-in stuff and we can see our ship right here, Harmony of the Seas. In the very back, if you can see, there's also Princess 
and carnivore. Yeah, but Grandpa is very excited right now. The ship he has waited for. All right, now we're walking on the bridge to board the ship. We're officially has set foot on the ship now. What is this, Central Park? Is this? No, this is the Promenade. It's like main area. What's it called? So nice. Promenade. We made it on the ship. And if you're an experienced cruiser, then you know how crowded and busy the ship can be in the beginning. All the elevators are occupied and the staterooms are not ready just yet. So the best thing you can do is find out where your muster station is located and head there to check off that box. Afterwards, the sea is the limit. This looks like a mall in here. It's like a mall in here. You actually look like you're in a mall. It doesn't feel like you're in a ship right now. All right, we're at the Royal Theater and I see our muster station, B3. We are now heading to Windjammer. We are on deck 16, but it turns out we're on the other side of the ship. So we have to walk across, but just walking across right now, it's so nice. There's like a water slide right there. We have like two pools here. It's a huge ship. Let's walk over and let's show you the food. So before we eat, there's a washing station where we can wash our hands. That's very sanitary. This is my first plate. I got some barbecue chicken, some fish, and that's a pork chop, I believe. Looks pretty good. Let's try it out. All right, this is the, my second round. I got some roast beef and a patty that looks really juicy, so I want that. And then I got some stir fry there. It looks oh, amazing. So we pretty much finished lunch now, and it's super crowded here because Today is the first day and everyone always crowds to the where the food is and that is the buffet on deck 16 Windjammer. But I think um, very soon we're gonna go find our rooms because our rooms are ready and we'll go from there. But yeah, this is the first step on one Harmony's of Disease. All right, so we found our room and our card was just there waiting for us. Now let's see the room, the first view of our room untouched. I think I'm gonna stick our card in. Okay, this looks pretty standard, but I like the colors though. It looks more bright. Really nice room here. Yeah, this is pretty basic. Basic cruise washroom. Same size. It looks exactly identical to the other ships I've been on. Anyways, this is the room tour. So this is what it looks like for a room with the beds together. It's the same as the other room, but this is one with the beds together. And I think it looks more spacious because the beds are in the middle. And the other one, they were like in the corners, so it makes it gives you a feel like there's more room here. And let's see. We have found everyone's room, and now we're just going to explore this humongous ship. And we're starting off in floor five. Okay, I don't know what this place is called, but it looks like a mall again. It's just everywhere is like huge here. Thank you. We got pizza. first day so a lot of people here right now are at guest services they have to get everything fixed and so do we we have to talk to them but while they do that I'm just gonna go here and enjoy the pizza this is the robotic bartender <laughs> Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. 
you like tap your card and then it slides it over. Like, yeah. 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 We see a dolphin coming up out of the water. Let's get fish. Let's wait till it comes back. Where is it? I think the chances of it coming back are pretty low. Oh, there it was. Not sure if we saw. Wow, look at this. This is an aqua theater. Look how big it is. And then you have a rock climbing wall, slides. Imagine while you're rock climbing up there, you can look down. The view must be so amazing. And like you can also see something from these balconies. Wow, like that's actually the best room on the ship. You can stay in your, the comfort of your balcony and watch the shows. Ferris wheel here and then over there they also have a Starbucks this is amazing we have finally made it on the ship Harmony of the Seas <laughs> part of Harmony is so lit there's like a hot dog house right there a lot of food venues there's a Ferris wheel there's like slides there's a zip line this part is just wild Here we are now at Central Park. Central Park now. This is really nice. And those people with the balconies there, that must be such an amazing view. A lot of greenery. You can put some chests here too. They have chests on these tables. See what's over there. This is a nice park. In the range, you can't come up here though. There's more slides. It's raining right now, and we're on Central Park, so it's kind of exposed to the outside. But we also saw this park cafe. Let's see what food there are here. We have found the fitness center on deck six at the aft of the ship. And man, I gotta say, this is really big. Of all the 10, nine ships I've been on, this is the biggest. They have so many things to do. I can't wait till I use it later. The ship's moving right now, so I wanna go outside and look, but I don't know how to leave the ship. So uh, there's a dolphin here. I think it's the same one we showed you before, but let's try to capture it again. Just need some patience here while it comes back up. 10 hours later. I don't think it's coming back. Oh, oh. Right We found like a model of Harmony of the Seas and this is really exciting because if I ever get lost I just come here and see what's here. This is actually a better way of me knowing what's in the ship than me exploring. Like here I can identify that was the Aqua Theater, that's the Flow Rider, that's the basketball court, volleyball court, mini golf, and then here we have the pools and the water slide. Man, look at this pool of those rooms. 
They got such amazing views. Yeah, true, the pollution. And you see here, this has got a little wire. Yeah, I think that's a zip line. I definitely want to try that. It doesn't look as bad as I thought. I thought it'd be like a cross, but it's like diagonal, so it's not as scary. And then here's a court for like basketball, volleyball. Definitely want to play volleyball, but if it's wet, we can't play. There's so much to do on the ship, but I think right now we're just gonna go to the wind jam. Wait. Whoa. Yeah, this is nice for pictures. That is nice for pictures. Look at that nacho bowl. Tell us what it is. We got some guac, we got some sour cream, some cheese, salsa, some pulled pork, and chicken. Wow. <laughs> Hey guys, we're at the gym right now and today we're working on some push muscles. So here we got this chest press. The gym's actually pretty nice here. Let's get the workout in. All right, Joachim's doing some dumbbell presses right now with some 45s. He's taking it seriously, come on. You got this, easy, easy. But yeah, we're just right now, all of us, we're getting a good workout in before our dinner. That way, I guess, when we eat our dinner, it's more rewarding. Turn the menu oh. Wow, so I was a little bit late today because I had to go shower after the workout. But here we are at the dinner. We're all sitting in the same table, so we have a very, very long table this time. Um, our table's at 7.45. It's a little bit later than usual, but we had to do this in order to sit together. And the food looks pretty good today, actually. So I got like a, a steak for the entree and also got a prime rib. So I got two, but I think I, for the sides, I told them to not to give me the sides for one of them because there's too many sides. I just got like a lot of protein. And oh, starters, I also got like um, S, um, I got a shrimp cocktail. So that's a one classic and a crab cake. And yeah, I'll show you the food. It looks very good today. So my first entree claim, the shrimp cocktail. Thank you. It looks pretty good. Got the sauce. It's good. My second entree came, the crab cake. It looks very good too. Let's try it out. You work from the outside, right? Yeah, that's right. You work from the outside. 
Looks pretty good. It's good, but I don't like it if it's not as thick. My first entree came the New York sirloin strip steak. Let's try this out. It looks pretty good. It smells pretty good. Some butter. My. The cut is pretty easy. Easy to cut. Not bad. So my second entree came, the prime rib. Really? It looks pretty good. Now let's try how it tastes. It's very easy to cut. Let's try the taste now. I would say it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Alright, so the dessert came. Strawberry ice cream. Not bad. It's like a typical strawberry ice cream. Now it's after dinner and we're at the Royal Theatre to watch a production called Grease. Um, let's see how it goes. I gotta feel like it's gonna be pretty good because most productions in Royal Caribbean ships are great, so let's see how it goes. Alright, this is the end of day one on Royal Caribbean Harmony of the Seas. It was a pretty eventful day. The ship is super big. There's a lot of exploring. We have yet to even explore like a half of the ship. It's so big. But tomorrow it's going to be exciting. There's like a lot of activities. And I would say embarkation day today was a success. Thanks for watching and see you guys tomorrow.